Don't tell makeup millionaire and YouTuber Jeffree Star that you use they them pronouns. The gay influencer used a recent podcast appearance to trash the whole notion of gender fluidity. He was on the Barstool Sports po uh, podcast, Bussin' with the boys, where the topic of gender identity uh, came up. Star said, quote, I'm not into all that other bullshit. The they and the them and all that extra shit we added during the pandemic because everyone was so bored in their effing houses and started to make up more more shit, end quote. Watch this. I'm not into all the other bullshit, I think. What other bullshit? The they and them. Yeah. And all that extra shit that we added during the pandemic because everyone mm. was so bored on their fucking houses. They just started to make up more shit and more, more shit. More stuff, more stuff. Yeah. That's where the like, conservatives like me because I'm just real. Yeah, you There's do no have a conservative vibe to you. You're not they and them. You're trans, you're male or you're female. And you're standing and on that. so mad when I say that. How are you a they? What the fuck does that mean? It's stupid is what it is. Yeah. But you need someone like me that looks like me to say it. Because if you say it, it turns into you're homophobic. You hate trans people. You hate gays. And it's just how you feel. You don't hate anyone. You just think it's stupid. This seems nothing less than one of his stupid attempts to get attention yeah. and fame. Jeffree Star talks down about pronouns. What are we all talking about? I saw you cringing while I'm, watching the video. Mean, you were just like... Okay, so he's saying it, so you can't necessarily call him transphobic or homophobic or whatever you but i will call him a fucking moron mm, yeah or an asshole <laughs> it's, if it wasn't for like like what is the big deal if somebody wants to be called they or that if you feel uncomfortable saying that find out what their name is and just call them by their and name that's it. and, and like, that's it. but it's like how is they how is it bullshit if, if we were bored during covid we were bored during covid so we would watch your fucking youtube tutorials on mm -hmm. how to Put make, How to I put on makeup put, on. I wouldn't put the makeup on, but I would be like, oh, that's a cool, you know. Yeah. You know, yeah. You know, yeah. No, and he became popular yeah. and an influencer during, during the pandemic when we had nothing the, else the, to go. The, to the pandemic where everybody was fucking bored and had nothing to do. So why aren't you? It's, it's educating yourself. It's educating yourself. It's elevating yourself. You know, when we started it's fighting, right. it was just L and the G. Yeah. Oh, my God. What was it? The gay, it, was the, it was the Gay and Lesbian Center. Yep, and then the gay, was, gay and Lesbian and, Alliance. And that, now that's it's how the it was. L, now it's the Lesbian and Gay. Mm -hmm. And then it's the other letter. And absolutely. Absolutely. If we needed to add 18 other freaking letters, we'd have to learn it's it. You not know? Just, it's not just a gay men's health crisis. No. No. You know what I mean? No, and it's, it's like, not all about you. And, oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. that's what, it's just, and God, you know, and you know, we were talking about like my mom, you know? My blood pressure. <laughs> <laughs> when you talk to people like this, it's just the ignorance, yeah. you know? And the fact that he has a shit ton of people that listen to him and follow him yeah. and will say, oh, then forget it. I don't need to learn about that they, them. He's right. I'm just going to, you know, Jeffree Star said so. I'm just going to call you whatever I want to call you. Well, then I'm going to call you what I'm going to call you. So, who wins? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, please. Jeffrey. No. Thank you, Jeffrey. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, thank you for raising his blood thank pressure. Thank you. Now I have to take a pill. Now he's going to take a pill. <laughs> and it's not even a fun pill. My job. <laughs> it's not even a fun pill. Not even a fun pill. No. no. Next, cornering the LGBTQ plus market can be a slingshot to success because when gay men earn good money, they know how to put it to more fun use. Glendale Girl Scout and new pint-sized gay icon, Sienna, have tapped into that potential to very, to very lucrative results. She's taken to selling her wares through West Hollywood's LGBT Rainbow District alongside her little sister, their mother, Jen Levin, and their TV producer aunt, Julie La Placa. This quartet of queens has been greeted by drag queens, hungry bar patrons, and open wallets, more importantly. Sienna apparently sells about 100 boxes single-handedly <laughs> each weekend, and it looks like she's having a blast doing it. Girl Scout corners we hold gays with cookies. What are we all talking about? We are talking about one smart little girl. Right? <laughs> you know what I mean? She's fabulous. She's got her little outfit on, and she's, like, selling cookies to get... What am I going to say? No. 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 And like, what if like, I just like, um, I don't drink, but what if it's like you're coming out and you're a little hungover and you want something sweet or whatever? Right there it, it is. So there it is. And there's nothing better than those, and, the, the, the coconut ones you like. What are and, they called? Oh, the Samoas. 
Oh, but the fudge stripe, the fudge, they're like elevated fudge stripe cookies because mm -hmm. they have the coconuts and they have the fudge they stripe. That little drizzle thing mm -hmm. going on. So good. But yeah, if, I, if she's out, if she's out in front of the, the if she's not in front of the Eagle. If she's in front of Abby, if she's in front of the Abby in West Hollywood, I mean, think about how much, you know? how many boxes oh she's going to sell. And what if like a, a drag queen is like standing next to her and saying, bitch, you better buy those cookies from that girl. That's it's it. done. She's going to be sold out. Done. It's a wrap. Okay. And look, and just think about all those like. <laughs> You know, because, you know, selling Girl Scout cookies is like a competitive thing. You don't like, want to go moms to Walmart. get mad. You go for the Walmart. You don't but want that to do that. But that makes more sense. Yeah. Like, okay, so can you imagine those other moms are like, why didn't I why think didn't of I that? that? Yeah, they would buy it because it's like, you know, you gay people want to help. They want to help you. Yep. Yeah. So, and we and like course, kids. And we, you know, we so want like, to, yeah, yeah, let's help. We don't, I mean, obviously you don't want to, you know, raise them, but you definitely want to buy exactly. cookies for them. I, I want to make kids happy. Exactly. I don't want to raise one. <laughs> But I want them to have a beautiful future and be who yeah. they are and sell a lot of Girl Scout yeah. cookies. And compete and win. I sold the most cookies. And guess what? Guess what? I, everybody was gay. Everybody that bought them was gay. Everybody. Everybody. What other kind of cookies are there? Side piece? Oh, Thin Mints? They're Thin Mints, Tagalongs, uh, Dosey Dose. Dosey Dose. Dose. I mean, like you're getting out of a club in WeHo and you're like, you want a Dosey You want a do I mean, come on now. It sells itself. <laughs> it <laughs> sells itself. <laughs> now we're going to see a bunch of Girl Scout cookies sellers in WeHo. Well, yeah, I mean, WeHo and Wilton Matters. Wilton watch. Matters, right in front of like the gym bar. <laughs> Think about it. You'd it make a lot of money or right there in the Hamburger Mary's parking lot. Oh People will go. It makes perfect sense. Yeah, very smart. Dang, we, I mean, we look like we don't eat in our community. Yeah. but we do burn it all off and we burn it all yeah. off <laughs> sex and at the gym with at little little gym, shorts uh, with the little jet north shorts <laughs> <laughs> so did you enjoy the show i know you did so make sure to click subscribe so you won't miss any of the events news or interviews right here on the Faye what show ring the bell at the bottom of the screen right there so you'll be alerted every time we're live. You can also click on the Happening Out Television Network logo so you can see all of the shows on the most diverse LGBTQ plus media network. Find out just what we're doing to bring the L and the G together right here on the Faye What Show. Get the week started with me.